Hi everyone, it's me, Darlene. It is Fabric Friday. I have not one, but two fabric listings for you guys on eBay today. Before I forget, the link will be down below in the description box and also in the pinned comment under this video. So you can head on over to eBay, probably like right now, and order if you want to get some. Last week, my order sold out in just over two hours but I have two different ones today so we'll see and I have more I've offered more lots so hopefully you can get some first lot is one-third yard cuts this is like you would go to the fabric store and say I want a third of a yard it's cut the full width of the fabric and a third of a yard is approximately 12 inches. Some of the ones that I've cut are more toward 13 inches. So I do make sure you get your full 12 inches in there. I have images on eBay, but let me just show you the combined picture right now. And as I'm putting them together, they look quite 70s retro to me. The avocado and that gold. We had the avocado bathroom and the gold kitchen. So, <laughs> it just reminds me of home. You are getting nine, five, and four. Nine one-third yard cuts, which equals three yards of fabric. And I bought five yards of each print, so that means I have 15 lots available for you guys. I think that's a good, healthy number, 15. Okay, so that's listing number one. Now, for listing number two, I am doing something different. Both the listings are different this week. I've never done one-third yards, and I have never done what I am calling fat sixteenths. There are such things as fat quarters and fat eighths. Well, I'm taking a fat eighth, and I'm cutting that in half, and that makes a fat sixteenth. You're ending up with about a 9 by 10 piece, so you should be able to get at least a 9-inch block out of there. I think it's a nice size, so let's go with that. I'm calling this a sampler lot because you are getting those smaller pieces, and I'm giving you 16 different prints for that. Since you are getting a sixteenth of a yard and there are sixteen prints, you will end up with one yard of fabric. But in sixteen different prints. These prints are kind of all over the place. I did not make anything cohesive. I just want it to be a sampler lot that you can put in your fabric stash and have fun with that. Let me show you the combined image here. And again, there are more images on eBay. For the 16th, I have 16 lots available, so you should be able to get one if you act quickly. I do want to say that because I require buy it now, when you order, you're going to have to pay the shipping on both if you order one of each, if you're able to get one of each. What I will do is after I have everything packaged and ready for the mail, I will go ahead and refund excess postage. I should be able to combine everything, I would think, in one flat rate mailer. Yes, I'm sure. Yes, obviously, because three yards and one yard is only four yards, and I can do that in one flat rate mailer. So I would refund you the excess postage, so don't worry about that. Don't get all caught up in thinking, oh my god. And it's just like if you get more than one lot, I just kind of guess like what an additional lot would cost. But if it's extra, if it's too much, I do refund postage. I'm not out to make money on the postage. I just want to get the fabric out to you guys at the best price possible. This fabric is not pre-washed, and this is a smoke-free, pet-free home, so you won't have any issues with cigarette smell. It's not cool if fabric stinks. I think that's all I need to tell you. Do go check it out on eBay, and if you want some fabric, I hope you get it. I'm going to try to do two different listings per week. We're just going to see how that goes. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!